right, I don't know how well this will come out. Um, I've replaced a broken gasket on the oil pump, uh, which had a little chunk missing out of it on the feed side, so that might explain the low oil pressure we've had on this machine. Um, I'm just going to put this airline in the end of the crank now. Uh, you can see my gauge isn't actually particularly accurate, but it does move under pressure. So I'm going to put this in the end of the crank now and blow some air in. That's holding it. If I pull it out, see that? Again, quick squeeze. That crankshaft is holding pressure pretty well. So I've got a feeling that the big ends, the shells on the journals on the crank, are probably in pretty good condition to hold pressure for that long, and that's air, not oil. So fingers crossed, the replacement of the gasket that they did on the oil pump should hopefully restore the oil pressure on this engine. As you can see, there's the, the oil pump. The gasket behind it was bad. The oil pump pumps oil out of this hole in to that hole there on the timing cover along that passageway. And then a seal keeps the oil in that chamber there, which fits over the end of the crank pushes the oil into the crank. So I'm hoping I'll put this timing cover on and oil pressure should be restored. All being well, we'll soon find out. I'll have another video to follow with the oil pressure clock on it again and see what we've got.